Hello, Durian here. I recently just got my very first ever Domiki keycap set. Let's take a closer look at them and then into the sound test and my thoughts on them. Enjoy! Alright, let's start with what I really like about the keycaps. I think it's very good value. The keycaps were arranged in a very tidy manner inside these plastic containers. The quality when it comes to touching them and typing on them feels very similar to GMK. One question that I always had in mind was how quickly these keycaps will shine compared to GMK, knowing that both of these are made out of the same material. Those of you who have had experience, please comment them down below. When it comes to sound, it is definitely more on the clacky or higher pitch side and brings more life into my keyboard, which I really enjoy. This might be because the keycaps are made out of ABS material. And my favorite part is the space bar. It is hella flat. And the spacebar sound comparing to my Novel Keys PBT Taro is definitely a game changer and is a huge upgrade in sound. Take a listen. In the subject of sound, I was also curious to see how it differs between some of the keycaps I owned and did a mini experiment. I'll be comparing between Domiki, GMK, and Novel Keys PBT Taro keycaps on the J, K, and L keys. In my opinion, the Dhamma keys and GMK sound very similar in person, while the PBT Taro sounded a little bit deeper and lower pitch compared to the other two. Some of the things I dislike were the misalignments in the legends, as seen here. The F is slightly higher compared to the other letters in the same row. Press F in the chat. Furthermore, there are some scuffed legends as well. The hashtag legend has some small misprints as shown here and also in the backspace. The legends on the alphas are good in my opinion, although the mods and the other functional keys are not as good as GMK's. An example would be the uneven thickness in the letters of the page up, shown here. Another example is the alt key, where the bottom of the letter A looks a little bit rounded, and the I in the shift key doesn't look as even compared to GMK. In my opinion, these are for those that want an upgrade from some of the cheaper and budget keycap sets, those that want a higher pitch sounding signature, and those that want to try out the triple shot keycaps to bring more color into your boards. If you would like to get this set for yourself, there's a link down below and I'll get a little bit of a kickback from that as well. I hope you enjoyed this video, like and subscribe as it really helps out the channel, and I'll see you all next time.